239 run lead with five wickets in hand after two days of play against the West Indies in Guyana. Sounds like a very good day for South Africa, and it was, but it certainly wasn't plain sailing. The Windies were dismissed for 144 in their first innings, a 16-run lead. Vian Mulder with his four wickets, Andre Berger three, Maharaj two, and Rabada one. He is now just four away from that magical 300, and hopefully he picks up those remaining four in the second innings. Started well in South Africa's second innings, a 79-run opening partnership, until the Sawzi was caught behind for 39. Markram then went on to bring up his 11th test half century, but shortly thereafter he was trapped in front by Moti for 51. Another three wickets then fell for just the addition of 19 runs. Vuma also LBW to Moti for four. Stubbs caught behind off Seals for 24. And David Beddingham was unlucky inside edge onto the pad and then onto the stumps for a duck. But Kyle Verena and Vian Mulder showing that they can certainly cut it at test level. Verena is 50 not out his third test half century with Mulder adding 34 not out to his four wickets in the first innings. South Africa 223-4-5 with a full three days to play in Guyana.